What's up guys, JFM here, welcome back! Today I have an episode of the Let's Play for you and I am so, so, so excited! And uh, one thing, this whole area was absolutely blown to, blown to shreds, blown to smithereens is what they would say, and I have no idea why. After I finished recording last episode, I went ahead and turned off my device as always, and when I came back in, I opened up Minecraft Pocket Edition and I was paused, but I was dead. So, so this was all blown up. Luckily, I grabbed some stuff, just put it in a chest. So I got a lot of cleaning to do. So um, this will take a while to fix, but that is not what we're gonna spend today doing because that's not gonna be fun. No, today I thought we would get revenge on the monsters that did this to me, and we are going to create an epic trap. And I mean an epic trap this thing is going to be crazy so there are a few supplies that I do need but hopefully we will be able to get this done today and I don't really know exactly where I want to do this either I'm thinking maybe by the cemetery or maybe over here probably by the cemetery I think that's where we're gonna do it so I'll head up there oh but before I do I should probably grab a few of the things I'm gonna need including some redstone dispensers all sorts of stuff this is going to be crazy so let's start it off uh, by quickly grabbing a bit of iron because I need a ton of hoppers uh, this redstone here because I'm gonna need some redstone contraptions and also I want to get a few bits of dispensers. So what this is going to require is it's going to require me uh, to make a few bows and hopefully a few, I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. So first things first, let's make uh, some of these bows with some uh, wood and sticks and of course I don't have what I need. <laughs> I need to go all the way back over here and grab a ton of the string I have from the mob drops chest and I'm going to have a ton and I mean a ton of bows it's gonna be crazy cuz I need probably let me do the math here Yeah, 25 I'm gonna need 25 dispensers so let's take a look and see if I can get this done I can make 27 bows so let's go ahead and make a lot of them I mean a lot of them down to that many let's pick them up please what oh they don't stack that's gonna be an issue well let's let's go ahead and just start crafting away some of these uh, some of these things wait whoa, whoa what am I missing here oh I need to actually make some redstone that's a bummer because I need to grab that so let's drop these carrots in the meantime shall we and nope okay I need to pick up one of these redstones please Please, let's let me <laughs> pick up the redstone. There we go. Okay, so now what we'll do is we should be able to make a few of these dispensers. So it's just time to craft. And hopefully, hopefully, I can pick up maybe 25. Okay, so what is that? Did I have, do I have them in my inventory? Look at that. Well, I can't pick up the rest of this stuff. Oh, there we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So we can continue making these dispensers. Don't know how many I have. Let's check. Oh, they're right there. They're on the bottom. Okay, 24. Let's make one more. And there we are. So now that we've done that, I think all that's left is to make a few repeaters. So we need actually the same amount. We need 25 repeaters. So that's going to be a pain. Hold on. Never mind, I only need 20, which is still a lot, which is still a whole lot, but uh, it is what I need. So let's go ahead and make a few more of these red stone torches, and uh, that should get us up to, what is that? I don't know how many repeaters, how many, how many do we have? 16, okay, so we only need four more. We should be able to do that fairly easily here. Just gotta make a few more sticks, it looks like. And uh, there we go, all right, so one, oh, that's not what I needed, right? Oh, no, I do need a few more torches. There we go, and we can finish it off with just one more redstone repeater. There we go, perfect, so 20 repeaters. Now I have a ton of redstone, the only thing I need to finish up this Shopping list of items is a comparator. So I need to grab a piece of quartz and oh my goodness. How did you get in here? Oh my goodness. What? No, 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 Stop going into the thing. Stop this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I'm about to die. I kept going into the interface. <laughs> well, okay. Uh, so I only need one comparator, not 20, which is great. So let's go ahead and finish this up and we should be able to do that with a few of these. <sighs> And where is it? Do I need another one? Yeah, there we go. And we should be able to make this build now. 
So, where do I want to do it? Well, that's the hard part. I guess I'll go over there. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do. Oh, the thing I need 25 of is hoppers, and I have just enough chests to do that. So, we'll make... Oh, and I think I actually already have a few, so let me just check. Let me just check. 23. Okay, I only need to make two more. There we go, and I'll put back the rest of the iron that I have, and we can go to the building site now. It's time to go. No more waiting. It's time, and this thing is going to be crazy. I cannot wait. What a perfect way to get revenge on these monsters. I cannot wait to show them who's boss. Okay, so this is the basis of the trap. What's gonna happen is all of these dudes are gonna fall down, right? into this here area that we've got going, right? All the way down here. Then, what's gonna happen is, uh, well, they're going to fall into this trap. I'm gonna accumulate a ton of them inside of here, a ton of those bad guys. And then, I'll basically unleash a hailstorm of, of arrows that's gonna kill them all. <laughs> and that is the plan. Hopefully it all works out to, according to the plan. Uh, first things first, I need to get rid of this last layer of dirt, and uh, we can get started with the build. Okay, so this is where the dispensers go. Now, I do know I made an extra five, but you know what? I can use these later, so it's not too big of a deal. But we'll go ahead and place these down, and this is what the arrows are going to come out of. All of those. So, after that, what you need is you're going to actually have some redstone behind these guys. Guys. So I gotta dig my way out of here really quick and uh, we can go ahead and do that So now what we got to do is we got to make a collection point and some redstone uh, Some oh wait, what is this down here? Do we have a buddy? Do we have a buddy? Uh-huh. Let's go. Okay, so hopefully this walkway uh, Well, it's it's sort of it's sort of a calling to me. There we go. Look at that We've made it to our dispensers So what I'll do is I'll dig a huge old area around all this so we can get all of our redstone placed down But I guess first things first let me show you the actual contraption that is going to have these suckers shooting like crazy. This is what we're going to do. Check it out. So, um, let's, uh, let's start with right here. I'll, I'll just build it. I'll just build the exact contraption. So, um, I'll probably move this afterwards, but let me just show you guys exactly what this is. It was sent in to me on Twitter, uh, and I'll get the user really quick. Yeah, the user was Wacky Bernardino, and this is a super, super, super simple design. Very, very easy to replicate. You just need to put down a comparator. Okay, uh, there we go. Perfect. And then uh, place your redstone like this, and then watch what happens when you turn the comparator onto whatever that mode is and flick this on. Look at that! <laughs> It is a machine gun of death. So, what's going to happen is I'm going to hook that signal up to each and every one of these dispensers. Or at least most of them. Because I think I may have a better idea for this. Hold on just a second. Sorry, I just had to do a quick uh, quick pit stop for the food, but we should be back on track now. So, the idea that I was kind of talking about was, I, I, I guess I originally thought, why not have, you know, their, basically every angle just absolute abomination, but I'm thinking I'm probably going to want to actually be able to watch the massacre, right? Because these monsters destroyed my dock and half of the house half of the dog house so you know what we gotta do we gotta watch that we get we, we gotta we gotta make a viewing room so what i was thinking was cover up here in dark green uh carpets with string over it so that the monsters don't see it they fall right into the trap kind of blends in with the grass when they fall inside i'll have a viewing panel right here that i'll be able to look through and basically just you know Watch them. So this side is not actually going to actually, it's not going to shoot out anything. Uh, this side, of course, is just going to be the viewing side. So it's going to be these three sides that shoot out the stuff. So this will have a nice glass pane um, right here where I get to watch. And then I should have a collection system with hoppers underneath. Now, the collection system is not going to be done today. That's going to take a little while. I need to figure out exactly how I want to get that to work. But for now, I'll at least put the hoppers down here just so you guys can get a basic look look of what this thing is going to be like. So, I guess first things first, let me go ahead and get all of these hoppers uh, placed down on the ground. So if I place that hopper against that block right there, I should actually be able to 
bring all of the hoppers. Yeah, okay, all of the hoppers are actually gonna end up facing that last one. So this is gonna be easier than I thought it was. This is going to work really, really well. All of the hoppers, I think, are gonna lead, yeah. They're all gonna lead right over to this one in the middle if I do it like this. Very, very smart idea. I like it, I like it, I like it. So I will place these last three down and let's try it out. So if I throw, throw a pickaxe over there, and then I throw a shovel over, oh geez, did not mean to do that, over there. <laughs> I should probably find a pickaxe, a shovel, and a piece of dirt in this one. Yep, of course, awesome. That worked very, very well. So we have a good collection system going. Now, what I need to do is actually hook up all this redstone. So let's go ahead and just put these blocks here and uh, this would be the window. For now, let's get this party started by chopping down some of these blocks. Alright, so take a peek at what I've got here. This is the lineup with the redstone. It's fairly simple, right? I just have this nice ring around here where I'll be able to add repeaters in front of each and every single one of these things and I'll uh, get the signal working. So, this is where I wanted to actually create the source of the signal with uh, the contraption I showed you guys earlier. So I'm going to need the lever which is where uh is it back here yep it is back here why is that over there i do not know but we'll go ahead and place this lever down right here and hopefully this will work i'm not sure if this is actually going to work the same way as it did um if it was just the block right there so hopefully it does i don't know we'll have to give this a go we you know what i'm open to experiments so let's uh let's give it a try so we'll go ahead and get all this stuff out and uh, let's see if this is actually going to cause the repeating signal that we need it to cause. So let's take a look. No, it does not. Okay, all right. What if I decide to place the lever on the bottom? How about that? Will that work? Probably. Yep, there we go. Okay, so unfortunately the lever needs to be on the bottom, but that's fine. Uh, so we'll take this over now, and basically I'm going to string this redstone along the whole entire floor, adding a repeater here or there a few times, just to repeat the signal, and, uh, and, and we should be good there. So one more corner, and I will be right back. Now, I need to place every last repeater along this direction, facing each and every dispenser, in order to actually uh, power each one of these guys up, and then of course I got Gotta add a little bit of redstone. Oh, no, 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 no. False alarm, false alarm, we need to fix this. There we go, this is how it's going to work. So each redstone is actually gonna be connected to the redstone in front of it, but also the uh, the dispenser as well. So let's go ahead and finish this last thingy off really, really quick. And I will need to place a little bit more dirt than I wanted, but this should work out great. So that is that, everything is linked up. Let's see if this thing actually uh, shoots off. Hopefully it does, I, I really do. So let's take a look, let's take a look. Um, do we do the honors? Yep, it looks as if it is, and oh my goodness, it is lagging like crazy. Oh my goodness. Okay, it works, it works, relax, relax. Okay, so now what I think I might wanna do is add a different delay to each one of these. Okay, uh, wait, hold on. Um, one, two, three. Okay, so it's just gonna have to be like that. Okay, so I'm just gonna add like a random delay to each one so that, uh, I don't know, it just doesn't seem like it's all shooting at the same time. They're kind of going at a different speed, which I think is gonna be cool. I don't know, maybe this is just gonna mess it up. Let's find out. No, okay. Yeah, it's, I think it's gonna work, I think it's gonna work, I think it's gonna work! Oh jeez, come on now, turn that off. <laughs> okay, now, what we need to do is we need to fill up most of these, and now I'm not gonna get all of this done today, but a lot of, of, this, uh, of these dispensers. So let's go ahead and do that, I have a ton of arrows with me, so I should be able to at least fill some of them up, at least, you know, get a nice 20 in each one, hopefully. And we are almost done. I actually have like 20 arrows in each one of these, which is pretty sick, which is very, very sick. So, uh, yeah, this is gonna be fantastic. This is absolutely going to be fantastic. We'll finish off the rest of this stack of arrows. We'll keep 64 for the personal collection, but that should be good. So now what I need to do is I need to lure some monsters into here. Oh, 
my idea of monster, but I will take it. This is the first bunny I've actually found that I, I, you know what? No, it's not the first one, but it's the first one that I'm taking back home. So quickly, while I'm waiting for it to be nighttime, because I don't know how long that's going to take, I will bring this little guy home, and he, can, and he can go into our farm. Pretty cool stuff. This will be our first little rabbit. Check it out! He's almost down! Look at this, look at this, look at this! There we go! We successfully brought the little bugger back! Awesome! Now we just need a friend for him, right? Because he's he can't be alone, he can't be riding solo, so we'll have to get him a buddy. But at least for now, he's got a nice home. We'll go ahead and feed him up, lovely little dude. And uh, yeah, now he's in there. Now I don't know if we'll actually be able to jump over the fence, hopefully not. But uh, it should be good. It's awesome, awesome, awesome. So he's in there now. And uh, it's still daytime. Oh, it's just morning time. Oh, man. Morning time. You know what? I will wait till we get more arrows to, and we'll put the carpet down. We'll make this thing official. But for now, I just want to check this thing out. I just want to see what it looks like. So let's go ahead and flick it on. And as you can clearly see, it is a, oh my goodness, this is not. Okay, off, 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 go the off, please. Thank you. Oh my God. Goodness, that is a lot of arrows, and I love it. <laughs> and I love it. Look at that. Look how many arrows. Oh, we are going to have fun with this, ladies and gentlemen. That is awesome. So I cannot wait to torch monsters with this. That is what they get for trying to blow me up. Jeez Louise. It, you know what? They deserve it. They deserve it. I cannot wait to try that out. But like I said, we need to disguise it a little bit more to make it more foolproof. So what we'll do is we'll add some string over it. Uh, some string over here with a nice dark green carpet to make it look just like the grass. The mobs will follow me over it thinking I'm gonna thinking they're gonna get me, but they'll just fall down into here. They'll get absolutely ripped to shreds. Their stuff will fall into this, and I'll be able to collect it in a hopper fairly awesome design now of course we're gonna make this thing look cooler but i would say it's a fairly sick looking thing already huh all right guys thanks so much for watching and as always stay frosty my friends peace guys see ya bye bye